Hello guys, welcome back to the Dorking Transfer Show and today there are some arrivals! Well actually, not today, but yes, today. You know what, whatever, but we, we've got three players so far for our transfer window. I don't think this will be the end of them, but you know, they're three quality signings. So let's get into number one. So, signing number one is Adam Mecky. Um, but he is a very highly rated winger and slash attacking midfielder. He's very attacking minded though. And uh, what I like about him is he's skillful and he brings a bit of experience because he's played up in the in the football league actually. He's played in like he was part of the Reading Academy and he's played at, for Tranmere, I think. Obviously Bromley and his most recent Ebsley. And he managed to bag a goal against us. I reckon since Matt Briggs is injured still until about Christmas, I reckon he's going to play right wing and he's going to be a very, very important asset to our team by getting crosses in, shots off, anything. On to signing number two. Signing number two from Ebsfleet's bitter rivals, Darkly. Now, he's highly rated midfielder, Jack Jeb, set piece specialist. Uh, that's what we needed, especially with Darren Oldacre going out the window. It's all round play. He, likes to, he suits our style of play, I think, down to the ground. Keeping the ball on the deck. <laughs> like from corners, like I said, he's a set piece specialist. Free kick as well, so watch out. He may score a free kick or two. Jack Jeb, oh, what a signing that was. I, I knew before he, it was even announced that would be the kind of player we get in, especially with Darren Oldacre going. I'm buzzing with this signing. This is like, I think these signings just add that extra bit of quality to our team. Obviously, probably still got a bit more to go with a keeper and maybe a young centre back. But, you know, I'm happy with these signings. Obviously, we've got one more to talk about. A third signing. What a signing this is, by the way. With the departure of Jason Pryor, we've gone and got ourselves Ryan Seeger from Hungerford Town. Ryan's a phenomenal striker. If you get the ball into the box, he'll score goals. It's simple as that. Just like Alfie Rutherford. Very lethal, especially, yeah, from inside the 18-yard box. Might have a pop from outside the box from time to time. Overall, Seeger, has, and he's got a very good relationship with Alfie as well, so... Overall, it's a win-win. He finished third in top scorer. Well, technically joint second with Sean Jeffers. Just behind, three behind Alfie Rutherford. He scored against us on the final day. Uh, yeah. He's, 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 very, he's a very quality player. He's played for, like, Southampton, MK Dons. He's played in the Netherlands as well. So, and he's still really young as well. So, who knows? I'm really excited to see all these signings in action in pre-season. Make sure to like and subscribe. Turn post notifications on for that as well, by the way. You will not want to... Do you mind? Um, but anyway, thank you guys for watching another episode of the Transfer Show. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure to smash the like, hit subscribe, turn post notifications on like I was trying to say. And yeah, I hope to see you guys at that first preview fixture. And maybe there might be one or two more transfer episodes, hopefully. I will see you guys in the next one. Peace out.